right, so let's talk about Parappa the Rappa. That's a, that's a name I haven't heard in some time. Parappa the Rapper, perhaps more than maybe any other character uh, in the PlayStation universe, is the ones that the fans uh, really seem to have a, a special appreciation and love for. At a broad strategic level, what's the best way to use Parappa? Parappa is an extremely short range character, probably has the shortest range of any, of any character in our game. When he is in close, he can perform a devastating attacks, punches and kicks, it's all in the mind. Delivers a lot of really cool and interesting devastating combos, and, and, and for the entire three minutes of a time match, he's just going to spend that entire time trying to get in close, do his great combo. There's a, a there's sort of a tap dance move he does where you can jump and push down a circle and just bu -bu 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 and just bash guys, batter them on the ground from above. We call this his thousand kicks. So he's got two attacks that are basically the cornerstones. So the thousand kicks, uh, Parappa will take an angle and sort of come in at a beeline. Once he's on top of you, he's really good at doing this. He can come straight down, deliver a bunch of sort of kicks all the way down your body. He's really good at, at, one, at generating a fair amount of AP, but also knocks the opponent down right on top of Parappa, which is exactly where he wants to be. The Thousand Fists, much like it sounds, is a, is a raining barrage of punches that Parappa uh, executes. Another move that's great for mobility and for hitting enemies is uh, he has a skateboard smash. Yeah. Now, the ground version, you can hit a guy with that and they'll knock down. Yeah. But the air version of that is excellent. You can dart halfway across the screen, you kind of slide when you hit the ground. You can I found myself wiping out multiple enemies in one blow with that. It moves really, really fast. He's pretty well protected while he's executing it. He can actually, uh, he's a monster at generating AP. Exactly. He can actually drop a boom box and make it. One of the few characters I've seen have that kind of control over their energy level. Uh, the side effect of that, of course, is then he has to protect that space because anyone can come in and pick up those AP balls. Let's talk about those supers, because as, as we said before, PlayStation All-Stars, it's all about getting those supers and getting kills. Yeah, so Parappa's Level 1 Super is a very sh short range kind of flip kick. It also has some additional functionality in that it can attack players who are kind of up and at an angle with Parappa. Um, it doesn't have the best range, but it is one of the, the uh, lower supers in terms of cost. But the level two is, I think, one that a lot of people are going to be going for. It's a, it's a yeah. go-to, it's a go-to super. Yeah. Hops on his skateboard and he basically blitzes through the level, and you have some control over him. Uh, if you can catch opponents uh, sort of all in a, in a corner, Hades, I think, has a lot of these little sort of nooks and crannies where you can sort of take guys by surprise, and you limit their escape routes very early by sort of uh, moving out to the side, activating the super, and then coming at them while they're all sort of trapped in a corner, really hard to get out of. And his, uh, his level three is interesting too. It's, it's, it's basically a, a screen clearing move. And that's the first one I've seen in PlayStation All-Stars. There, there's a very hard kill limit on that super. You're never going to kill more than three people uh, with Parappa's level three super. Now what would you say for a beginner? What's the best uh, strategy starting out first time with Parappa? The best uh, starting strategy with Parappa is to get familiar with his thousand punches and his thousand kicks. You'll be using those attacks a lot. Players who like pushing buttons, uh, players who like believing in themselves, um, all of those I think attributes lend themselves really well to, to being a Parappa player. Thank you.